Alright guys, good evening. Uh, got back a little while ago, I actually just edited a video. But I uh, did some grouse hunting while we are out on the trap line. Uh, set some more traps, uh, like 10 more today. Uh, we checked all 50 that I got out this morning. Uh, no luck. So uh, we went further down the line. Uh, I'm quite a ways away from camp now. So hopefully we'll get something out there. Um, but while we're out there, see, we come to an area, uh, there was grouse pretty much all over the place, up in trees, everything, so, uh, figured why not, right, have a good dinner, so, got my two grouse here, that I shot, now we'll, uh, process them up, get them on the frying pan that I got from Tim and Helen, uh, they have a YouTube channel as well, it's, um, homestead and a rental I believe is what it's called uh, they do a lot of prepping type stuff you know canning different things uh, grow their own food and stuff like that it's pretty cool so go ahead and check them out if you haven't already I've done this a couple times before it doesn't always come out perfect but we're gonna give it hell here take and step on the wings and you should be able to grab right by the legs and most of this stuff coming right out So the head, most of the guts, a lot of the feathers. I still got the legs on here that I gotta cut off, but that's fine. Still got some guts on here. So yeah, it didn't didn't work perfect that time, but like I said, it does it doesn't always. Fighting some more guts there. I'll try to do a couple bobcat sets maybe tomorrow uh, now that I got these wings and feathers and stuff. Man, I wish it would just break off. There you go. So, yeah, nice feather. Hang up as an attractant by a set. Get them interested in over there. That's the heart, we'll save that. So that's one. Well, like I said, didn't come out perfect, but get the job done anyway. I'll just strip these two legs back here. Wanna grab me that uh that little knife? Should be right by the sink. <laughs> Kenny's like, I don't know, I wanna eat that thing now. One tendon giving me fits there. Plastic baggie. Where is it? I don't even know. I thought I brought it. We can take it out here.
To make fletchings out of this? The tail feathers? Yeah. Give me the other ones. The other ones are bigger. Which one? Yeah. On the wings? No, the, on this bird. Oh, yeah. One bird done. Get all this stuff. Definitely throw them on some sets tomorrow, that's for sure. Alright, try this one, see if it comes out any better. Tail feathers. Almost. It's cool dude, you can see right inside this thing. Got some like tips of pine branches, some greens. <laughs> That's the hot. The other ones are actually the gizzards. Eat gizzards? <laughs> I'll try it. Uh, I don't eat it either, usually, but I think I've tried it once when I was a kid, so I would stand a reason why I didn't like it. I'll definitely try it again, though.
So some feathers for fletchings. Uh, Kenny actually made a 60 pound uh, quickie bow. I don't know when was that, second or third day we were up here. I mean within an hour he had this thing shooting. I think I got clips of that on the uh, Camp Chores video. He's shooting it in the background. Um, so he whipped that up. I actually had a piece of flint in one of my kits. So he asked for that last night. Whipped up a pretty nice point for it. Uh, I'll show you guys a clip when I get a chance on that. Came out pretty good. So I think we're thinking uh, got one more be beaver left. Try to get some of the uh, sinew off the back of that. Uh, harvest one of the branches out here from a tree for the arrow shaft. Uh, put the point on it that was from me. And uh, some feathers for the fletchings. It would be a one trip deal on a homemade arrow. Kenny's like phenomenal with that shit. Uh, he's got some good videos too. Check him out. Fox Walker 1111 on YouTube. He's got some pretty good stuff. Uh, shoots a coyote with a self bow that he made. Crazy stuff. Alright guys, so we're going to go inside, clean these up, and get to cooking because I'm so hungry. Yeah, I'm hungry. <laughs> Alright guys, so we go. Four breasts, four legs. <clears throat> I only got one of the hearts and uh, both gizzards right here. Got my two cast iron cook pans here. Like I said, I got from uh, Tim and Helen. Get some fire to those. Fire. Put some beans on in the back. Maple beans or regular baked beans? Whatever you want. I like the maple. Big can of maple beans. My favorite. Some butter on this pan. Big one there. Dude, these are going to be absolutely fantastic. I'm trying 
Roger Bendis a mistake, I believe you. I haven't had this, like I said earlier, probably since I was a teenager. It's been a long time. I'm afraid I didn't check that. Appreciate it. Throw some salt and pepper on these dudes. I'll tell you what. Ooh I was hungry before, now I'm really hungry. <laughs> <laughs> this is gonna be crazy, man. You know how many people are gonna need to go get something to eat after they watch this video? <laughs> so there it is, guys. All I gotta do now is serve it up. <laughs> Pull that butter right on there too, boy. All of it. Dude. It's gonna be a heck of a bathroom night, I think. <laughs> All that butter, the beans. Can't wait to try this gizzard out. Some Sam Adams. Just fits, I think. There it is, uh, video cut off, not sure where, but a little editing will fix that, right? Look at that. Good stuff? Mm. Yes, sir. That is one good third. Mm, don't get no crushing in there, huh? Really good meal here. So I uh, just want to say thank you to Tim and Helen again. Thank you guys very much for the pens. 
Uh, I know somebody's gonna ask if they haven't already uh, what happened to my trappist cabin that I was building up here that uh, project kind of got shut down uh, the people that own this place mainly my in-laws but there is an outsider they kind of got together and uh, nixed that due to liability purposes you know, I can't blame them but they still let me come up and use the camp so uh, definitely wanted to put my pans to use uh, they did the job tonight it was an excellent meal so thank you guys again and I uh, will see you guys real soon with another video